today i will be showing you how to open a google mail account if you are wondering what is the benefit of opening a google mail a google mail account can be used to send and also to receive electronic messages or electronic mails without wasting your time let us go straight into the uh, tutorial You open your favorite browser either on your mobile phone or on your laptop computer you go to the web uh, browser tab then you visit Google okay I'm right here on Google so just click on Google open a Gmail account So as you can see here, here is a page, a registration page for opening a Google Mail account. So for the sake of this tutorial, I will be creating a new Google Mail account. I already have my own personal Google Mail account. I have another one for my business. But for the sake of this tutorial, let's try and open a new one right now. So I'll be using digital then. Digital D R E. Yep, I think that one is super cool. Okay, they said this username is already taken. Try another. Okay, let me use this one D R E Digital Zero. So you're gonna choose a password. And um, there is a special clue for selecting a strong password here. You are going to select a password that is not easy for hackers or those who want to intrude into your inbox, into your mail. You are going to choose a password that will be very difficult for them to guess. So the suggestion is that you use eight or more characters with a mix of letters, numbers, and symbols. So following this formula, I already have a password that I want to use and let me quickly insert the password. So here is my password. I'm going to insert the password again in the second tab. So I've entered the same password into the first and second box here so you go to next creating your google account okay my location is nigeria and um, google is requiring me to verify my phone number what is the benefit of verifying your phone number the benefit is for you to be able to um recover or to secure your google mail account for your security for your security google wants to make sure it's really you they will send a text message with a six digit verification code next so they have sent a code to this my number here and um i just received the text message now i'm gonna Insert the number right away eight six seven six four six. So these are the six, this is the six digits number. Then you click on verify. I just want to use the okay for date of birth. I'm using May. Second year, let me use year 2000 just for the sake of this account. Well, gender, 
male, female, rather not say, I'll rather not say. You can choose your gender if you are opening your own. But for this basic uh, tutorial, I'm using rather not say. So you click on next. So click on I agree and then Google is gonna prepare a new account for you so as you can see now a new Google mail account has already been created for me and now when you open a Gmail account there are other things that Google will create for you that you will have license to use so having a google mail account actually entitles you to have access to other services that google provides for people a few of those services are you know using having a channel on youtube having an account on google play store and um, the gmail itself having an account on google meet where you get to do meetings online this is just like the zoom application what zoom provides for you google also provides the same then google chats google contacts will be able to back up your contact your phone contacts on the internet using google platform then you have access to google drive where you'll be able to store your files and data then google calendar google translate actually you might not need a google account for you to be able to translate but it's good if you have a google account I mean it is free of charge so there is no reason why you should not have a google account then photos you back up your photos on google this is also an application that you can use to make video calls that is google Duo. so there are other services that google render that you can access for free of charge google docs google sheets google slides you get to learn how to use many of these applications as your need demands and we're going to treat some of those um tutorials here on this channel so let me just show you to your inbox account straight away so you just come to this tab then you click on where is google mail okay this is this gmail so just click on gmail so as you can see a new gmail account has been prepared for me and um, here is my new gmail account and uh, if you want to view your email address you come to this side here so this is the email address the one i just created here is it you can see it so creating a google mail account is as simple as that now you may want to do certain customizations on your account customize your inbox change your profile picture if you have a prepared picture you wish to use on google you click here then to import your contacts and mail you can come to this tab get gmail for mobile if you click on this tab here what is going to happen is that your phone is going to get the gmail application for your mobile phone so as you can see here i have a message an unopened message a new message so they are asking me to finish the setup of my new google mail account but i'm gonna do that later okay so you will notice that after i click this message before I clicked it, actually, it was actually bold, but after clicking it, it is on bold. So that it signifies that you have already opened the message. 
Thank you very much for watching this video. I will see you in another video. And if you have not subscribed to this channel yet, kindly subscribe to this channel to get more videos. And also click on the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever I post new video. Bye. See you again.